Hi everybody and welcome to my channel. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by to today's video where I'm going to be talking to you about what it means when you see angel number 1111 and what that means for you in your spiritual journey. Okay, so thank you so much if you're just now tuning into my channel, welcome. And if you are already subscribed to my channel, I want to say thank you so much guys for your support. My subscribers are really going up there and I cannot be more appreciative of you guys and your support that you have for me. So let's go ahead and get into what it means when you see angel number 1111. All right. So there's a lot of misinformation out there on the internet about angel number 1111 and all angel numbers really, um, but really angel number 1111, um, there's a lot of misinformation about how this number basically means that every single thought that you're having is about to come true. And I'm here to tell you right now that that's not something you need to be worried about, um, controlling every single thought that you have. Obviously, it is good to think more positively and be more optimistic in life, but as far as analyzing all your thoughts and making sure you have zero negative thoughts whenever you see angel numbers, um, it's pretty much impossible to sit there and only have positive thoughts, okay? So that's not something you have to worry about. I'm here to tell you that that's not what angel numbers mean. Um, especially that's not what all angel numbers mean because they can't all mean the same thing. And there's just a lot of information, a lot of articles, a lot of YouTube videos, a lot of um, things on Google and the internet that are saying that angel numbers in general, all of them, and especially angel number 1111 means that every single thought you're having is going to come true and manifest itself. And that's not what it means. So what angel number 1111 really means is it basically means that the timing is perfect right now. That's what angel number 1111 means. I've personally have an ex have had experiences with angel number 1111 where I would see the time and I would see that it was 1110 or it was 1112 and I would always miss 1111 just by like seconds. Or I would always be too early to see 1111. And it's not even that I was taking note and trying to search or trying to see angel number 1111. It's just that after a while of me just seeing how close I was to seeing 1111 on times, on license plates, everywhere, I was starting to wonder, wow, this isn't the number I see that often. If anything, I see every single angel number except for 1111. So it was something that I really kept into my mind and just uh, something that I put in the back of my head to consider um, if I ever did see angel number 1111 to really analyze it and understand what it is and why it came into um, my life. So angel 1111, I started seeing a lot after I made an extreme um, life change inside of my life where I changed my job completely and I started doing um, other things that were more along what it is that I feel is my um, life purpose. And after I was on the right path, it's like I was seeing 1111 all the time and everywhere. And this is why I truly do feel and have experienced that angel number 1111 can be here to tell you that the timing is perfect. The timing is now. So angel 11, number 1111 is a number that basically tells you that the timing is perfect. Now what the timing is perfect for is exactly this. The timing is perfect for you to basically go ahead and speak to the universe. It's not about every single thought you have coming true or the universe hearing every single thought you have. No, it is however about the universe hearing what it is that you're in saying with intention that you want in your life, what it is your desires are. So when you see angel number 1111, a portal is being opened up and a gateway is being opened up from, from you to the cosmos. 
where you can connect with the universal energy and the universe is actually listening to what it is that you are expressing you want in your life right now. So when you see angel number 1111, it is a time to basically go ahead and make a wish and state exactly what it is that you want in your life. Even if you say what it is you don't want, it's not like the it's not like the universe is going to basically say she doesn't want this, I'm going to give it to her. No. So it's not about every thought coming true. It's about exactly what you say with intention that you want out of life. So go ahead and just when you see this number 1111, say exactly what it is you desire. Say it exactly what it is you want in your life, whether you want a new house, whether you want abundance in your life, whether you want wealth, whether you want health, whether you want to achieve certain specific goals. You can be really specific about what it is that you want the universe to um, basically give you or that you want to manifest inside of your life because the universe is listening because the time is 11 11 and a gateway a portal has been opened up where you can connect with the cosmos connect with the universe connect with heavens and basically state exactly what it is you want in your life and watch it manifest in your life over time okay so this number is all about perfect timing and i am sorry guys if the lighting keeps going up and down in this video um it was supposed to be a sunny day but the clouds are just going over the sun over and over again so i hope that you guys can still see me in this video um, i try to find the best lighting that i can um, and this window seems to be uh, where it's at. So sorry if it's not really working to its best advantage right now. But yes, angel number 1111 is basically a portal and a gateway being opened up. So it's an extremely positive, positive number. And it's a number that is nothing but good luck because it's a number that not everyone has the privilege of seeing. When you see angel number 1111, depending on what it is that you're experiencing in your life or what it is that you were thinking about when you saw this number or what it is that this number is pointing to for you, when you go ahead and look into your intuition and dive into what it is this number is pointing into your life for, um, you will see that it's telling you that it's perfect timing regarding that situation okay that you're on the right path regarding a certain situation and right now you can manifest what it is you want out of that situation so it can play out the way that you want it to play out all right so it is an extremely positive and lucky and fortunate number that really brings to you exactly what it is you want in your life it's almost like seeing a shooting star and making a wish. It's a number that really brings miracles and things that you basically um, didn't think would happen into fruition. For example, if you got a text from somebody, maybe one of your friends that you haven't spoken to in a long time, and the last time you talked to them, it was a time when you guys kind of got into an argument or something like that and things were really rocky and then all of a sudden you get a text from them and you look at your time that you got the text and it says 11 11 when you see the text it's 11 11 in this situation it could be an example of now's the time to really state exactly and have the intention and vocalize what it is you want out of this situation um, if it ended up rocky, now is your time to really look and say to the cosmos and the universe, wow, this person's contacting me right now. I hope that we can resolve or move forward from whatever it is that we had argued about or whatever it is that got in the way of our friendship or relationship. And then go ahead and message them back or continue doing what it is that you were going to do regarding that situation. So that's just an example of exactly what angel number 1111 comes into your life for. It comes into your life to really basically 
help you manifest what it is that you want out of a situation, out of an experience, or out of whatever it is that you're thinking about when you saw the angel number 1111, okay? It does not mean that every single thought you're going to have is going to come true because it's impossible for you to think everything positive, to only have positive thoughts. That's impossible. And it's ridiculous. And the only thing that's doing is instilling fear and anxiety into people. When you tell people that every single thought they're going to have is going to come true, it's ridiculous. So that's not necessarily what this number means, okay? So the best way to interpret exactly what area of your life this number is really talking about or where it's trying to um, really um, um, send guidance for you is by listening to your intuition and listening to exactly what it is that you're experiencing, thinking about, or the feelings that come up when you see this number. And it is possible that you see this number just at the perfect timing for you to make any wish that you want, whether you know exactly what it is that angel number 1111 is coming up in your life for, it is a time where you can make a wish and you can voice and vocalize and ask the universe what it is you want the universe to help you manifest. You have the support of the universe when you see angel number 1111. You have the support because a portal and a gateway has been opened up when you see angel number 1111, where it's basically telling you that you've connected on that frequency with the cosmos where you are capable and you have the support you need to really manifest what it is that you want in your life. And since you've connected to that frequency, it is also possible a lot of the times, not all the time, but it is possible for you to see angel number 1111 and also have a buzzing in your ears a lot around the times that you see angel number 1111. Okay, so thank you so much for tuning into this video, guys. I really hope that you guys could learn something from the video, and I hope that you guys enjoyed watching the video. And if you did enjoy watching it, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up for the video. And also subscribe to my channel because I make videos every single week, um, multiple times a week, about different synchronicities you might have on your spiritual journey and how to really understand what those synchronicities mean. And I'll also be leaving a link inside of the description box to all of my social media accounts, my Instagram, my Facebook, where I do daily readings. And yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.